Hey guys, Retro Badger here. So yesterday I reinstalled Voyager Elite Force with the expansion pack and I thought I'd make a video about the add-on pack basically, the expansion one. Um, so if you've never played it before, you might enjoy this. It's really cool. You get to go all over the ship and do what you want basically. So you can go on all the decks, use the transporters, use the turbo lift. There's a few little mission things you can do as well. And you have the tricorder, which oddly tells you what everything weighs. What's he reading? Ponfar? Oh yeah. And we're in um, Monroe's quarters at the moment. Okay. So yeah, it's basically just a add-on pack which lets you explore the ship. Oh, he's a fan of the next generation as well. That's cool. Ensign? Seven. I must commend you on your tactical analysis of our situation earlier. Okay, let's see if I remember what the cheats are to this game. That's right, type in SV underscore cheats space one, and then type give all, and it will give you all the weapons, including Captain Proton's uh, ray gun. allocate a certain percentage of my time to leisure. It is inefficient, but I see the wisdom of the practice. You've what just got to listen to her talk for a minute. Uh, whatever. Okay, now we're free. Oops. Alex? Whoa, that was close. Okay, so it's already given us some missions to do, but you can just go around the ship exploring. Security access required. That's right, you need to get the security codes. So I think the first place we should go to is the computer core. Specify deck desired. Which is... Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Oh, it does this. I, I select it and it won't let you do it again. You have to walk out. Let's see what happens to her. Yep, she's gone. Specify deck desired. Okay. Computer deck core. Nine. Yeah, there it is. Apparently that's what computer cores are going to look like. The 24th century. Now from what I remember, it's quite hard to get to this computer core. They've hidden it. Okay, my uh, hyper spray is not working on anyone. That's a shame. We could also knock a few people out. Oh, this was that corridor where the big explosion happened. I remember that. I'm stuck. Can't fit through. Now oh, here's a turbo lift. Don't let me in that way either. The map you can't even read. Hello. Hello. Right. How do we get to this computer core? Like I said, it's quite hidden. Ah, Jeffrey's tube access. So we're getting warm here. Whoops. Right. Oh, this place is a maze. Oh, it might be through here actually. Hmm. How big is this ship? Ah, here we go. Oh yeah, these are scattered around as well. Elite Force action figures. Access codes granted. Okay, so we've got the access codes now. So now we can basically do whatever we want with the ship. Ooh, we're gonna have some fun with that, aren't we? Okay. I wonder if anyone's jumped into that computer core. Oh no, I'm stuck again! Oh, Neelix is cooking. I was eating too many uh, Denoblian worm pies. Oh, can't fit through. Right, when all else fails, we'll do no clip. If you type in no clip, you basically become like Q and you can just do what you want. Oh wow, look at this. 
They used to do this with Doom years ago. Okay, let's just uh, float through. Okay, here we go. So no clip off. Specify deck desired. Okay, let's have a think. Deck eleven, engineering. Let's go and check on BLT. Surely we can cause some mischief. The warp core. Ah, what do we have here? Displaying power relay access code. Cool. Access granted. Power relays have been cut. Haha. <laughs> it's funny how even on the Galaxy class ship, they have an area over here that overlooks the warp core. I like that. It's like continuity. See how tough a warp core is. Oh, that's surprising. In the show, they you know they say it's basically like as um, fragile as paper, don't they? Don't look at it funny, or it'll blow up. Okay. Warp core shut down. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, in the um, single player game, if you remember, you have to actually do that or it, to stop a warp core breach. But you can actually do it for fun in the expansion pack and just turn the warp core off. It really annoys um, BLT. Is there anything else on this deck? I can't remember. Oh, that's clear. Not. Specify deck desired. Hmm. So deck three. Let's go to the officers' quarters. Let's see what the quarters look like. Do you know, the I've not actually done that before. Tom, oh, cool. Turkey platters. Whoa, why is that floating in the air? That's a bit strange, isn't it? I guess that's a way of getting the proton gun as well if you don't type in give all. Oh, cool. I've never seen that before. Surprised they didn't make like a little animated series. That'd be a good idea. The quarters of Ensign Tom Paris. The quarters of Lieutenant Milana Torres. <laughs> Engineering toolkit. Okay, there's not really much else in here. The quarters of Lieutenant Milana Torres. Whoa! Oh, there's another one! Cool. Wait, so this is Chakotay's quarters? Chateau Letter. Ooh, Klingon blood wine. Yes, please. Albanian brandy. Mm, maybe not brandy. Wow, that is a big screen. So he has a view screen. Look at him. Uh, quarters of Commander Chakotay. Hang on a second. Oh, right. That's his office. Fair enough. The quarters of Commander Chakotay. Wow, he doesn't have uh, far to commute, does he? Oh, cool. So you can go through the personal log. About how much he hates Tuvok, no doubt. Sirloin steak and corn salad. Well, I imagine if replicators were real. That's a small bed. What's going on? Oh, it's like a... Whatever they're called. Those things you the lounge on. Commander Chakotay. Sorry, I'm kind of busy here. The oh. quarters of Captain Catherine Janeway. Oh, cool. Well, 
you would expect it to have the biggest quarters. Hey, cool. That's a um, beer mug. A German one, I think. I used to have one like that. That's crazy. Cool, phonograph. She has a record player. And a sword. Assuming it's ceremonial. That's weird. A photo from the looks of it, a black and white one. Cool. The quarters of Captain Catherine Janeway. The quarters of Captain Catherine Janeway. Oh yeah, she's got the two doors. <laughs> Tuvok. There's nothing in here at all. Minimalist. Okay. The quarters of Lieutenant Commander Tuvok. The quarters of Ensign Oh, we've done a circle. Specify deck desired. Let's see. Visit deck 15. Well, we've not done that Specify yet, but you can't desired. access it directly. But I remember you have to use the um, transporter. Four. Here we go. Also, this is one of the missions, funnily enough. So, yep, there we go. We completed a mission there. Uh, right. So these aren't deck numbers. They're site locations. So. Transporter activated. Here we go. Hey, there we go. Transport successful. Borg Slayer. What's that? What is this? Uh. Okay, so. Where? Okay, it it looks like we've got some sort of platformer game here. This is interesting. I can't see my character. It's like a, a, a puzzle, I think. Okay. I've never seen this before. It's crazy. I didn't know this even existed. Oop, better watch out for the Borg. Oop. Oh, gosh. Vaporize. This kind of reminds me of the um, Easter egg in um, Elite Force 2. You know, the Mario one where he's jumping over things. It's going to vaporize the Borg. What I remember about using the phaser rifles, less hits the better before they adapt. So if you use the low power setting, you've got to hit them like six or seven times to knock them down. But that's six or seven hits that they're working out. So if you vaporize them, you get more shots. Let's see. Oh. Oh dear, I'm running out of ammo. Great. See, look at that. They've adapted. Um, okay, let's try the scavenger rifle. I don't think we're going to get many shots with that. Okay. Destroy so we need to generator. disable, yeah, the shield generator. There she is. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. How do you ask nicely? Ooh, this drone's nasty. Oh, there's a photon torpedo launcher. I'm assuming we've got to hit the green boxes. Ooh, stasis weapon. Ooh, one shot kill, I like. Didn't stand a chance. Whoa. That 
Oh, so it swivels the staircase around. What's the point in that? No? Okay. Yeah, this uh, viewpoint is very strange. Oh gosh, you should take full seven too. Nice to meet you. Still not not the force field down. Um, hmm. Yeah. Okay, we'll try and get on here. Ah, that might be the last one. Oh, so that's open the door. Oop. Okay. Done it. Impressive. No, thank you. Now what? Uh, how do I exit? Uh, computer end program? No. Hmm. We're stuck on the holodeck. Without seven of nine. Okay, that should hopefully get me out of it. All right. I go there. Yeah. Okay. Explore deck fifteen. Hey. Sorry, don't have time for chit chat. Oh Raven, so that's the uh, developer. Oh I remember this. Yep, look at that. Make the undercarriage well that's gonna annoy a few of them on the bridge, isn't it? What's going on? I don't think there's much else down here, to be honest. Specify okay. deck desired. Deck two. Let's go to the mess hall where my most favourite person in the whole Starship universe resides. Not. God mode on. Q mode. Really? They should call it Q mode. If you come back later. Haha. <laughs> I try and do this at least once a day. All right. Oh. Hey, I'm taking damage here. What's going on? Even though I've got God mode on. It's not fair. Uh oh. <laughs> I love this Neelix. Sometimes it is. I don't know what you were thinking, Anson, but you'd better straighten up or you might be spending a lot more time in here. Oh cool, so I get to come out eventually. Hey, that's not bad, so I can kill Neelix and get away with it. Well, I'll leave it there for now, I think. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye for now.